Now it's important for the jetter operator to keep this Y strainer clean in here. There's your screen. You want to make sure that this screen is clean. You would hold it up to the light and look through it. Kind of like, uh, like I can see there. The screen is clean. You can see through it. But you want to make sure that's clean so that this pump can get proper water flow. Otherwise it gets restricted. You'll start losing your pressure. It'll kind of almost feel like you got air in the system. You're going to see some knocking kind of going on, but it's a little bit different. You might be have good pressure when it's um, low RPM, and then when you start to bring up the RPM a little higher, you might notice that your pressure doesn't increase or it actually starts to drop. That just means you got a restriction, and most likely it's the screen. Uh, when you go and clean the screen, and you're going to replace it, you just want to make sure that it's properly seated and that the gasket is in place. Back inside of here, inside the wire strainer in the back, is a rubber gasket. That's right about where your screen sits in that crevice. You want to make sure that that gasket is in there and it's in place inside that little crevice. It's like a little seat back there. You can see it maybe. It should be sitting in that seat. And then you go ahead and install your wide strainer screen. And you want to set it into that seat and then it should push in like that so at least it's kind of flush. Then the last thing you want to do is just make sure you do have a O-ring on your cap or it's a flat rubber gasket actually on your cap. And then you know you're going to install your install your cap and then over top of that you're going to put your C-clamp and snug it down and you should be good. You just want to always make sure Got this rubber gasket in place. Without this rubber gasket in place, some trash, rust, debris, metal can get past the screen. It'll wind up plugging up your uh, oil cooler or messing up your pump right on down the road.